What's up guys, Sean from Quastech. So this is a bit of a vlog. I am moving, hence why my garage is a bit of a mess. Um, but this is how you know how you've got too much stuff. In amongst everything I found this, which is a Titan CG8890 gaming PC that Rog released about five or six years ago. So I'm gonna have a look at it because I haven't opened this box in a long time. So I didn't do an unboxing because it really sucks to get out of the box and it's a very big box but this is the CG8890. Now this case was released as a pre-built system uh, about five, six years ago. It came with a Rampage uh, 4 formula, a uh, 3960X and your choice of a 590 or a 690 from memory. Anyways, so this is the case. Now this looks like a big tank looking thing. It actually it looks pretty awesome for a pre-built, um, but that's not even the best part. Push this button. Okay, so no, if you've never seen this case before, this was the first sort of transforming case. Now, these here have got these little 80mm fans that are ridiculously noisy and probably don't provide that much airflow. I haven't actually done any testing yet. But yes, so we've got LED under here. We've got the ROG logo and we've also got fans here which are meant to pull air out of the back of the case. Now this case here is a sample case and I was just in the right place at the right time when I got this case. So the styling of the actual case is pretty awesome but let's pull the side off and have a look inside. Okay so with the side off it is basically as generic as they come okay so this is a mid tower only um, this is just comes with a 350 watt power supply to make everything work because it is a sample case um, yeah it is really really basic to get everything squeezed in here as a pre-built would have been a challenge and now I'm gonna build in it so basically my question to you guys is what should I put in this thing I've got a couple of ideas, I've still got a couple of Ares 3s I wouldn't mind putting in a build. But yeah, to water cool in this thing would be a freaking nightmare. I mean, you've got one fan up here, which is meant to be to pull air out of that top intake we had up here. Got nothing in the bottom. We've got a drive rack, 5.25 inch bay. Uh, this is the control board for all of the panels that open and close. And yeah. Um, I can't put EATX because of this is all raised, similar to the Fractal Define um, R5 and onwards. But yes, this is going to be my next challenge. So in the front, yes, we do have card readers. That is how old this thing is, but could still be very useful. Um, three 5.25 inch bays. Um, I'm going to put a ROG front base in here. But yes, when you pull the side off, it is basically a very basic mid-tower. Uh, mid-tower, and that's it. Not painted. I have a feeling that the, the retail ones were painted. And I think because this is a sample, it was not painted. So my first, my first um, business is to pull it all the armor off and paint that black. And then I think I'm going to ripple this out and create a, a rad in the bottom here, I think, to pull in under, because to try and water cool in this thing is gonna be awesome. So yes, that is gonna be my project after I move. So let me know what you think of the case. A lot of people didn't even know this thing existed, and that's why I wanna build in it. I acquired it, I paid a, yeah, not a massive amount of money, but I did pay a bit of money for it, so I wanna use it. I want to do something really cool with it, so yeah. Yeah, so what did you think of that case, guys? Um, it's pretty awesome. I am looking forward to building in this freaking thing. Um, I'm probably going to be out of action for a month to two months. Uh, I got to move, I got to set up my new space. Um, I actually have to build in a garage space like this, so I'm going to have a lot more room um, to have a lot more of my hardware on display. 
but uh, yeah this is gonna be by my pet project after after all that's sorted so let me know in the comments what you think I should put in this build um, obviously ATX is is what I'm limited to I can't go EATX water cooling is gonna suck but that's part of the challenge right so yeah um, if you think I should mod it somehow let me know I'm not sure how much we can mod with it. I don't really want to mod the outside of it because I just love the authenticity of the case. But yeah, let us know and I will see you in a couple of months.